I'm Elizabeth Mays, Marketing Manager for Pressbooks, and this is your monthly dose of Book Smarts. You're probably wondering, how do I get my book out of Pressbooks and into the bookstores? The answer to that is simple. First, check that your book is complete, make sure that everything looks good, then you'll want to change the theme. The theme is really your book's layout and design. You can choose from a variety of pre-coded, pre-designed themes by clicking on Appearance, Themes. We already have a theme activated, but you could try any of these out and change them at any time. We also want to customize our theme options. There are three types of theme options to customize. The first are the global options. These apply to both the print and ebook exports of your book. We have a couple options here, whether we want to display chapter numbers, whether we would like a one level or a two level table of contents, and whether we want the copyright license to show. We can check our various options here, click Save Changes. Then we'll want to discuss the PDF options. The most important setting here is the size of your trim, which corresponds to the trim sizes in the various print-on-demand and print publishers. You'll also want to decide whether or not to display crop marks and enable hyphenation, which again will vary by the type of publisher you're sending your book manuscript to, so you want to ask them what they prefer. You can also decide whether to indent or skip lines between paragraphs, and whether or not to include a blank page in your print PDF version. The reason for this is so that all your chapters start on the right page, as you would normally find in a book. You can also choose whether or not to display your table of contents and how to handle your footnotes, widows, and orphans. Again, you'll want to save the changes for the PDF options. And then move on to the ebook options. You'll want to decide whether or not to indent or skip lines between paragraphs, but most importantly, you'll want to decide whether you want press books to compress your images for you. Some ebook stores, like Amazon, will charge you a digital delivery fee based on the size in megabytes of your book. Larger images mean your book will be a larger size, so here's where you can get that down a little bit. Again, save your changes. Next, all you need to do is export. You will notice that this book is free. That means that the Pressbooks promotional watermarks will show up in the exported files. If you're going to publish your book, we suggest that you remove those by upgrading here. You can upgrade just the ebook, or you can upgrade to print uh, as well. Next, all you have to do is click Export Your Book. You'll notice a couple options here. The first is a PDF, which you want if you're going to do print or print on demand. The next is an EPUB, which is the output file that you'll take into the Nook Store, the iBook Store, Kobo, Smashwords, any of the others. And the Mopi file is for the Kindle Store. Your book has exported. Now all you need to do is download each of these files to your desktop. From there, you'll upload them into the bookstores. 